Hello, so schoolboy error. Um, you're now joining me um, after I've just started playing some Deus Ex Invisible War um, because I didn't realise that the I hadn't deleted the previous data from the memory card. So the game is paused. Um, why is it trying to load a save? Um, right. So yeah, sequel to the uh, PC. Um, original, um, which was also available on the PS2, albeit in cut down um, form, so what I was saying just before I realised that, um, yep, okay, yep, yep, whatever. Yeah, what I was saying before I realised I'd run out of space was that the original game it was groundbreaking at the time that it was you know a first person shooter and you could pick stuff up and throw it like the basketball that was pretty cool at the time so um, I look for apartment 454 although there isn't any actual numbers on any of these rooms oh, it's, it's the door to the corridor somebody's died um, so 454 where's that 451 must be down this way. Here we go. Uh, next one then. Uh, no, must be down here somewhere then. The fuck? 452, down here. Um, yeah, there we go. As you can see, um, as I keep Tending to have to say, um, oh fuck. Um, was there an alternative way in here? This is the thing with uh, Deus Ex, is as usual, usually multiple ways to um, achieve the same task, so. Like that's a vent you want to be going into, really. Um, it's kind of a um, game set in a, a cyberpunk um, setting. Sake. Oh, intercom. Fuck's sake, how fucking simple is that? So that's my name, Alex. Alright. Yeah, we got to talk. Take your pennies off and get on that bed, bitch. I'm gonna fuck you in the ass, ginger motherfucker. Blah blah. So basically, um, you know, you got RPG. Well, it basically is an RPG, um, Deus Ex, and uh, so we've got the code for the elevator, and now we can go down, so we can travel to there. Kind of not seamless, but uh, hopefully the loading time won't be too bad. Yeah, um, it's it's a game that is a first-person shooter, but it's an RPG, and you've got um, character development. Um, you've got like augmentations that give you different skills, um, like hacking and um, guns. You know, like increased accuracy, like say augment your arm for increased gun accuracy and things like that. 
So it just says it's a compass. Great. Just mincing around, looking for some shit. For soda machine, yeah, you've got soda. All of these um, sodas and things like that are basically, um, you know, like items that replenish health and all of that sort of gubbins. I don't want to go that way. Go downstairs. You bonehead. Blah 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 blah. <laughs> God, so you basically got this um, you know, storyline going on. Right? Um, oh yeah, it gives you um, do sex. Always gives you um, the choice of lines of dialogue to um, answer with. I'm just skipping through all this now, um, and they basically affect the um, the outcome of the story, how it branches, or you know, has a bearing on your uh, character development. Needs to fuck off. Um, fuck the way down. Get down again. Uh, down here. Still mincing. Mincing around Christmas tree. Yeah, happy holiday. Mincing around the Christmas tree and people are fucking gay. And if I was shot at the fucking oop in it, it would be an achievement if it was in the Xbox 360 in it. Oh, and he misses because the physics are slightly very off. Yeah, whatever. Um, I probably should have actually read the dialogue to see what the uh, objectives were. What about this again? Can't go in there, I guess. Let's see, uh, primary goal: meet Clara down the hall from Doctor Nassif's office. Oh, there we go. Hey, bitch. I like to rub them titties. Yeah, baby. Yeah. So basically, everyone's completely 
ignorant and thick as fuck down here. with all the shit and I think is it in here? I go for shit is it here? this is what we can open there we go so we can open it now got some ammo got me a back on there we go alright More shit, stock up. No, I don't want a freaking mortal. tool. Oh. Fucking kill people with a fucking locked multi tool, lock pick type shit. There we go, pistol, we'll have a bit of pistol. Can't say it, there we go. Quick. Right. Bloody see where I'm going now. There is a flashlight, but uh, don't really need that. I can't see where I'm going. Where did you pop out from? Why's the lights in the arm? Nah, fuck that. I'll just shoot people. Yeah, we don't do stealth. We don't do stealth, we just short shit. Yeah, faggot. So you can do um, the usual shit like pick shit up when you kill people, all that good stuff. Um, yeah. the apartments it's kind of a it's kind of a hard game to do a short video on um, cause it's kind of slow moving but once it does once you do get into it is uh, an excellent game it's definitely worth picking up it's a game that if it had um, you know current gen graphics it would basically the, the gameplay depth would fit right in with what you play nowadays really sounds like a plan to me cover me when i charge him i mean i can handle it by myself sure i've got your back let's go nah fuck that just shoot people there we go there's a go why is my gun not fucking... Conveniently, you can uh, leave the. Yeah, I don't need to use the ladder. Oh, it's bloody. Uh, yeah, sorted. We're out of it. Yeah, conveniently, you can go through your apartment into a lab. 
there just happens to be a uh, hole in the wall. Let's check my phone. No one's ringing me. So I've got HIV. And that's misery. God damn, it's gonna be hot today outside. So we're in the we're in the lab. Blah 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 blah. Blah 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 if we uh, pick these up and then we press the black button to install the biomods um, and as you can see you can develop your character fit um, fit different biomods and uh, see here you've got choices you can have healing or uh, night vision go for healing type shit and you can activate and deactivate different skills because they drain energy um, and I think there's batteries and shit that you need um, See, we can see better now. So that's a quick look at Do Sex in the Middle of War. I'm not in a great gameplay and mood today. Maybe because the sunlight outside is just kind of mirroring me out there. Um, but yeah, it's definitely a, a good game. There's um, quite a bit of depth to it and uh, different story outcomes and all that sort of stuff and some great action and set pieces. So. Um, I've played it before on the PC and it is a great game and well, the two other games Do Sex the first one and Human Revolution are also great so definitely worth checking them out as well.